Hello everybody. Um, after three weeks of the broke girl for broke dead body, I don't know, we really ain't gonna call ourselves a name yet, but uh, we got our first uh, sponsor. This is a light from Panda Villo, and it's 200 watt, and it's dimmable, and we're gonna take a look. I'm excited, I hope you're excited, because this light is only going for $90 with the promo code or something like that, and it's on Amazon. This is on Amazon. This ain't this ain't coming from no unknown places and all that stuff. So you know Amazon works pretty quick. Oh man, he's like, hey, I mean it's you gotta get some elbow grease. Like Christmas. You know what I'm saying? So I'm opening this box you that's a okay we got a box inside a box let me sit down for a second so i can take out the important box that's the important box right here because that's got the light okay let me just set this to the side real quick sorry but this box we can make another little crazy grill box out of it or something Bam, there we go. There's an important one. It's like two presents. Now I get another one to open. And like I said, this is a, this is 200 watt LED. I think two, 240 diodes in there. And they have a 100 watt, and the 100 watt's pretty cheap. I think it's like, Maybe 32 bucks, I don't know, but you know how sites are with the taxes and stuff. It's kind of hard to calculate it, but it's 32 and then a little sales tax or whatever. But I think Amazon's doing the uh, it's tax included and the, and the delivery. So, I mean, $32, $32 for a light, that's not bad. This one costs 40 and I guarantee that $100 light from Panavillo is doing way better than that. And I don't even need uh, my grow to test that. That'd just be common sense. And then they got the 400 watt, and I think that one's going for um, 200 or 199. You know, they say 199, I'm just gonna say 200. <sighs> Sorry guys. Hey, they package it good. I'm over here putting elbow grease in this. You know, got the nice styrofoam in there. You just toss that away. Okay, this is the important part. These are your directions information. This tells you all about the light side or the lighting and what type of uh, or the frequency. The we'll get into that later. I gotta pull it up and look at it. The frequency, but everything. How's it going? We going? Oh, okay. And then, like I said, you got your hangers. You got your bag of hangers here. But I'll hang it later, but we'll plug it in and see how it looks. And we'll turn all the lights off and all that stuff. And, uh, This is, this is what they call the driver. I call it the ballast, but they call it the driver. And they got the number on it. I mean, it looks fairly decent, it says input. I forgot the name of this guy. But if I see it in the info when I'm reading it off, I'll let you know it. And then, you know, you don't ever want to pick it up by the driver, you know, it's got screws and stuff. All you gotta do is you sit here, flip it upside down, and it's just gonna fall out your styrofoam. You get what I'm saying? Now here's the chipboard right here. That's the LED right there. Like I said, they look down there, probably about 240 of them. And then, uh, it looks like the IRs are coming out of, the infrareds are coming out of here. You won't see the infrareds, you know, 
And then they got all their different lights with the different type of Calvin spectrums in there, you know. And then they got the, you'll see when we plug it up. It feels pretty nice. Sorry, we just throwing boxes around. At least we ain't throwing lights around. So, let's see. I'm gonna plug this in here. Let's see, I might need to find my plug. Yeah, okay, here's my plug here. Sorry guys, I'm used to, I'm used to old technology. I'm sorry I don't have rendering to speed this shit up. You know, I guess if they, I guess if they got to put commercials in here, they might have to bleep me out. I will bleep me out though, if they want to put commercials in here. But I really don't care if they want to put commercials in here. I ain't doing it for that. I'm doing it to help the sponsors out because I bet you this is a good life. And then you got the Mars here. You know, that's their competition there for the spider. But, uh, you know, that one's okay. That one was 150. $50 more. This is a dimmable switch. This is a dimmable switch right here. So we're just gonna put that over here. Dev guys, this video might take a little minute because uh, you know, if this is the first time you guys hooking one of these lights up, you might wanna watch because this is the first time with me hooking up one of these lights. You know. So they, so we know this one's power. I'm gonna set the power over here. And here's your hangers, huh? That'll be the next video. I took down the lights that's grown over the plant, so I have to put this one up after I'm done with this video. Let's see. Switch. That one, okay, let's see. Let's see here. Okay, so this got three holes. And this got the three holes. So let's see the three holes meet the three holes. And then you know we got the right side to it. You can come over here closer so they can see what I'm trying to do here but yeah it's got three holes here i have a problem hooking these things up winding them up and everything i might have the camera person do it she's a little better at it. winding stuff up but do you want to hold it so i can do it yeah See what I'm saying? It's got three holes. And this one, and this one's a dimmer one. I know that one's the power one. See, it's because of my MS, I ain't got the deck silly to do that stuff. And then uh she's gonna hook up the dimmer one here. See how the lines up there. Sorry about that. We got a cat playing with a box. Thank you, uh, Panda Villo, for giving me another toy for my cat. Can you get that one? This one's hard. Yeah, there. it's new. I'm trying not to bust the prongs. Nah, nah I to, them are pretty thick prongs. It'd be kind of hard to bust them.
So you gotta put some power in it, huh? Mm. Sometimes they have to dump there. Don't, don't rest on the LEDs. Yeah, but anyway, this this is a 200 watt light, and it is. Sorry about the camera stuff, guys. She's got that. This is a 200 watt light, and um, the other video he did plug it into the reader, and it was reading 200 watts out of out of the outlet. And you know, and when I read the directions, it said the power was. It's at 200 plus or minus, so you you know if it's a little hot, it might be 205, and it's a little cold, much. But still, though, that variation ain't bad. I don't have all the equipment to test all the lights, but this iGrow guy, he tell, he's he's got real good testing in it. He's got the real good testing. Now, see if I plugged it in, it kind of freaked me out. It's like, oh my God, it's not turning on. Maybe this dimmer switch here. It's probably in the off position. Oh, there we go. Oh yeah, that's right. <laughs> oh, that, that, that's even, oh yeah. I can tell you right now looking at that light. I don't know, I gotta turn that down. I don't wanna look at that like that. It ain't growing me, it's supposed to grow my plants. Oh no, I turned it off. Yeah, but this light is, I'll tell you this. For $90, this light is way brighter than that. And I don't need no tester to tell you that because we're probably going to plug that light up too. Can you guys see that? There. And like I said, you, you can see the infrareds. Here's your infrareds here. And then you, here's your blue, your little blue respectrum. And then here's your little red spectrum, you know. Calvin's, that looks like about maybe... Um, I don't know, 3,000, I don't know, they change it, they're different, I, like I said, I'm used to these guys, but this is your red spectrum, and this is your blue, blue spectrum, kind of like the dual spectrum, but I like using two different light bulbs, but you know, this is a cool light, I'm not even going to lie, we're going to plug up this Mars, you know, we're going to turn this off, while we plug up this Mars, you know, sorry about the time, but hey, if you're interested in buying one of these lights for $90, you might want to watch this. Uh, let's, let's go with the Mars. This Mars ain't even got a dimmer. You know what I'm saying? I mean, if you really want to, I'll plug up the old dinosaur for you. We really, really have to rock it. I might even do that. You know, I mean, because you got to stop watching whenever you want. I'm just showing you. I'm just showing you guys. Definitely, I like that. Just by plugging in, I like that. I don't need no tester. Shit blinding my eyes. Sorry about my language. I'm trying to be professional, but you know, after three weeks of doing this, I mean, it's really not professional. There we go. Oh, I'm just blind in the camera, huh? We'll be showing off lights. We might as well just show off lights. And this guy cost me 150. That, I mean, that's that. It's still bright, but the thing is, this one is wider than this one. And they say with LEDs, you know, with LEDs, the wider is the better. I mean, yeah, this light's cool, but you see the infrareds in there. You see some of the LEDs, but I really can't tell the difference between the reds and blues. It's just kind of like just one false spectrum or something like that. I'm telling you, after looking at all these lights, I'll be blind. You know, that one's just kind of like a white light. Just a white light. You know what I'm saying? 
And that one's not demo flow, so that one's just that one's just freaking it's it's cool, but you know, that one's quoted for a two by two for 150. This one can do a two by four because it's wider, so it diverges the beam better when the the LEDs are wider set. Okay. Already plugged in, I think. I got two lights plugged in there. Ah, there we go. There's nice that is. Yeah, this is a pillow willow 200 and I can tell definitely by looking at the room this has got a wider pro area than this other than that one there So yeah, they give you the manual with the specs, and it says this frequency is uh, 2.7. It says, uh, I wouldn't say the frequency they said was 2.7. I'm trying to look it up so I can give you guys the exact, exact correct thing. Sorry about for the long video, but hey, if you're, one, if you're interested in the light, you think the time. Because they have the PPF. Yeah, the PPF on this one, it says 600. PPF says 600, I want to say, joules per second. I can't even understand the unit. You guys that had to Google and figure that one out. But the efficiency says 2.7. And that's... Uh, you know, another unit that I really don't understand. That's why I would watch a guy named Micro, M-I-G-R-O, and he'll explain all that in thorough detail to you. I just wanted to expl I just wanted to show you this light, and this light's nice and bright, and I'm gonna post the link of Panda Villo so you guys can get the discount if you guys want to choose this light. But now, I gotta go install this light in the tent and then we're gonna test how she grows. Guys, thank you for watching and I hope, uh, I, hope I uh, ex showed you the light. Like I said, I'm gonna uh, link everything to where you can get more information on the actual specs but yeah thank you for liking and thank you for following thank you for subscribing and uh panda Villo, thank you for sponsoring you guys have a nice day i gotta go hook this up